Hey guys, this is Apple Gamer 24 7 I'm here to give you guys a update video for you guys today on some updates I'm going to be doing to the channel and also why I wasn't making any videos for the last month. So sit back and I'm going to tell you guys what's going to be going on and why I wasn't making any videos. So starting off, the reason why I wasn't making any videos for the last month is because my iMac, the computer I mainly use to edit all my videos on, experienced a hard drive failure and I needed to replace it and I it, it happened to line up with exam week and I didn't have the time or the money to go out and spend at, uh, at the Apple store to wait for the Genius Bar to fix it and as you guys know from my last experience with the Genius Bar it wasn't really that good so I just said screw it I'm going to a Apple uh, authorized service provider and I'm going to get fixed over there it happened to be about two hundred dollars cheaper than Apple and actually it's probably the same quality so I'm actually really impressed and I probably do. I probably will uh, make a video explaining uh, why I chose the Apple Service Provider over the Genius Bar. If you guys are interested, that's the whole up to you guys. But I'm interested in making it. But if you guys want to see um, why I chose the Service Provider over the Genius Bar, just let me know in the comment section below. So I just got my iMac back yesterday, Monday, and today's Tuesday. I'm still in the middle of getting all my programs up. I like uh, Compressor, Fonca Pro. Uh, iLife, iLife took me a while. A surprising iLife took me a while. So I'm still working on getting all my programs in, but I should have the, I should have all them in by tonight. So by Wednesday, I should have a full working system. But in the meantime, I just thought I might uh, tell you guys about some new um, updates I'm gonna be doing to the channel. Some new videos I'm gonna be doing. So I have some notes on my iPad over here in case you see me look over this way. It's because I'm just looking at my iPad for some notes. So the first new video I'm going to be doing is gameplay videos on games I want to make videos on. Uh, before I used to make videos on uh, this Call of Duty gameplays, I never really worried about any other games because I didn't think people would watch them. Or I'm saying screw it, it's my YouTube channel, I can do what I want. I'm going to be making um, video game videos on games I just want to play, making commentaries. I'm also going to be probably doing some Let's Plays on Halo 4 and um, Call of Duty Black Ops 2, if that's what they're called Let's Plays, I'm not really too sure on that. Um, so I'm going to be doing um, some walkthroughs on that and some commentaries based on me playing the game. Just overall having a good time, some um, freestyle type videos, not worry about if the, how my voice sounds or if anything comes in right to some. Some freestyle videos. Um, before, I'm also trying something new out with this too. Uh, before when I used to do commentary videos, I used to do it, uh, play the, record what I wanted to record and then do the voiceover. What I'm planning to do now is I'm planning to record and play at the same time. So while I'm playing, I'm recording my voiceover. So it's going to be a live voiceover. So I'm really excited to experiment with that, and if it doesn't work too well, I'll go back to the other style, but I'm just trying to experiment on which way does best. So gameplay videos are starting tonight. I should have my next, I should have my next one up, maybe by Thursday or Friday, I should have um, made my first gameplay video up. So I'm really excited to do that. So I hope you guys like it too. So that's my first uh, new type of video. My second new type of video is prediction videos on Apple events. A lot of people... When you do predictions at Apple events, they try to make it so they want one specific product and not listening to rumors or any other sites that point to what's being announced. Or even if it's a press release from Apple that says, we're announcing this at this, people immediately think it's this. But no, I'm here to just tell you guys what I know and what I think. And most of the time, what I think actually comes true. So I really think these out. So I'm going to definitely be doing predictions on Apple events. Um, I'm going to be starting that maybe, maybe in August, September towards the iPhone 5's release date and the fall, October time frame. So I'm going to be doing that closer to October. So definitely predictions on Apple events are here to stay. And I can't wait to start those videos up. Um, as, I, as you guys know, before I've been a lot of time viewers, I used to do uh, iPhone and iPad um, and iPod Touch. Uh, app reviews. I'm starting those back up again because they're just fun videos to make. I love telling people about new apps and games I have on my devices and I think it would be a good way to uh, for some app developers to get their apps out there and just um, overall just uh, give you guys some applications that you guys might not know about. So app reviews are coming back to the channel and I might have one of those up, maybe not this week but next week since I'm going to be doing the gameplay videos but I should have a whole list of videos I'm going to be doing now but definitely app reviews are coming back to the channel. Um, my unboxings and my reviews aren't going anywhere. I'm still be doing those when they come, and I just can't wait to start doing uh, those again. Those should be fun. I do have two that I'm gonna upload out tonight, actually. So I'm gonna have two unboxings up. So definitely check those out when they're uploaded. So that's all about the uh, new videos I'm gonna be doing. I have some other updates I'm gonna be doing. Uh, the first one 
is I'm gonna be telling you guys a site, uh, a new website that, I'm, that I started writing on um, this past week. It's called RoachTechnology.com. Now you may have heard of it because uh, the YouTube user CPU Kid on YouTube. Uh, anyway, um, he started this website um, based on his Hackintosh content, and he was asking people on Twitter if he wanted um, any. Uh, writers or people on the write for his website, and I just said, "What the hell? I might as well write for it." So I sent an application in with a sample post, and uh, by far he picked me. And I'm having a lot of fun writing for. It. I have two posts up right now, and I'm planning to add more as time goes on. But um, I'm really excited about this, so I want to give a shout out to Bob CPU Kid and say thank you for letting me write on your site. It's been a lot of fun so far, so thank you. I also have his YouTube link and his Twitter in the description box. And now for the last couple um, shoutouts, I have to do uh, two more shoutouts. Uh, the second shout out is to Neat247, uh, my very good friend Neat247 on YouTube and on Twitter. Uh, recently made me a new YouTube background and a new avatar picture. It looks awesome. She gave me exactly what I wanted. It was definitely worth what I gave her, which was iTunes Bunny, and it was totally worth it. So thank you, Neat247, and her link is down below in the description. So definitely check out her videos. She makes some amazing videos and I want you guys to check out her website and tell her I sent you. Um, and also Nightgamer1988, I think that's her username, I'm not sure, but she recently made a video for me um, saying that I was streaming on Block TV on Sunday and uh, that was just really cool. I wasn't expecting that of her and it was just a big thank you. So thanks Kira, that was really nice. So that's all my um, Shoutouts and updates and basically what's been going on. Um, I should have more videos coming up this week. So anyway guys, uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, uh, just leave them down below. Make sure to like this video to show support and I will see you guys later.